Previously on Apprentice A. Corey's gonna film a video. I'm gonna film a video. Dogs! No! Done. Yes! It's the middle of the night and Corrado just opened the freaking door. That's terrifying. They're washing our windows. Yay! It's really creepy though, and I don't really want to watch them dangling outside our window. <laughs> so weird. The cart's much longer than I thought it was, and I didn't think it would have wheels on it. They're fast. They just rolled down from the last window. Oh really? Yeah. Really They're like they just they just lowered themselves below our window. We're really awkwardly probably gonna be looking up. They're right there. Just down there. Look at the lack of watermarks all over our windows. It's easier to see. It's so nice. Very excited about this. I just want you all to know that I've uploaded another video. It's not Monday, but that's okay. Close enough. Um, it's called Why You Suck at Driving. Corrado suggested the title. And it's basically just me talking about the fact that driving and Toronto GTA area can be a disaster sometimes. So there it is. I'm hanging out. You can find it on my channel, Saskia Vanel. We'll link it in the thing and in the outro. Or description, outro, whatever. You get it. Corrado's at CBC right now doing CBC things. But he's been freaking out all morning and like messaging me stuff because Radiohead, I guess yesterday or the day before, like deleted all of their social media stuff, like all their tweets and their posts and their whatever, it's all gone. So their Twitter still exists, but like it's an empty Twitter. And then today, uh, and like late last night, they started posting little, little bits of things. And then uh, just now they posted an actual song on their website. And Corrado is freaking out, and it's adorable. It's so funny. <laughs> I'm glad he's happy. There's quite a party happening behind us. Right also over, known as a right baseball game. Also known as a baseball game. It's very fascinating to like, because we throw an event, and like pay a lot of attention to like the flow of traffic and where people are and what they're doing, and there's like, Hot dog stands outside with huge signs. And the signs are like, you can bring this inside. Buy it from me because you can bring it inside. That's just really funny to me. Apparently there's stuff happening over here too. There's a, there's a band. <laughs> it's a weird mix of music. We got I know. And marching band. That's very weird. So we're gonna take a look at the Union Station, she said. <laughs> That's a great idea, she said. It's not confusing in there and half under construction. No, no all of it's goes. under construction. I don't know where I'm going. It's also really weird because it looks like an airport. And it's like I did not pass through any security to get in this part. But we, there's signs for front streets, so we're going. We're, we're figuring out. I feel like we took the longest way possible. Probably. It's an adventure. You did say you wanted to go on an adventure. I did say. So. Look! Past the construction, look how pretty it is. You know? And then all the construction. And then all the construction, go that way. We found some doors. Hopefully they're useful doors. This is outside. Yay, we did it! It's this way. Long way. Yeah, but look at all the cool adventuring we just did. Those are what they call Gouda bombs. <laughs> Uh, so we're at the beer mart, which I'm very excited about. And it's a very, they have like beers and whatever. There's Dutch writing on the wall over there, which is very exciting to me. And these, is it's Gouda cheese, deep fried, with like tomato sauce. Go ahead, try it. It's better be good, because I've been hyping it since we left the house. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, so good. I got a pork schnitzel. This is like enough for four people. Yes. You've got a pot. A pot. What's in the pot? One kilo of muscle. Sheesh. Very cool. This place is cool. Going yeah. fancy. Yeah. Does it taste good? Yeah. Yeah. 
good. Look, it's Dutch. Also, it's English over there. But, you know. Now you don't have to go to Belgium. Monica Piss. He's a huge deal in Belgium, by the way. Monica Piss is like a huge deal. There's a statue, it's basically that size. And that's all he does. He just pees water like a fountain. The story, I think, pretty sure, is that some general in like the 1500s or whatever um, was fighting some other dude. And then the homeland guy had a two-year-old kid and they raised him up in a tree as like moral support in a basket or something. And the kid, the two-year-old kid peed on the, op the enemy general's head. So they erected a statue of him. The more you know. I don't get to see this view very often. Also, there's a, there's a go bus station here. Look at the hordes of zombies everywhere. How are we ever gonna get out of here? It's really weird because there's no like organization. So they're all just kind of wandering. Looks really creepy. There was no cars, man. You would think there were zombies everywhere. All right, my friends, it's time for bed. I had a shower before I went to bed. I don't know how I feel about that. I'm more of a morning shower kind of guy, you know? It feels weird showering at night because you gotta do your hair. Because when you wake up in the morning, if you don't do your hair, it's just a disaster. And then you gotta wash your hair anyways. So you might as well just wait to shower in the morning. But I just felt like it. It's one of those things. Are you a morning shower? afternoon shower or an evening shower kind of person. I have a feeling most people are going to be morning. I think that's normal. I could be wrong. Anyways, I'm going to bed. Oh, and uh, oh, and more important news than going to bed or anything. Uh, Radiohead released a new song today. Just totally just dropped the track uh, and totally blew my mind. It's called Burn the Witch. It's on their YouTube channel or Radiohead.com and it's phenomenal and I'm really excited for another Radiohead album. Okay, now I'm gonna try to sleep. It's not like I own all the Radiohead albums or anything. I'm just really excited for a new one. Alright, let me go to bed. Good night. Home is where the fog is.